So I joined up with two friends, two very good friends, uh, who had already started the idea of fundraising without any clear idea what they were going to do. They just knew they had to do something. Um, and then we decided to buy ambulances. It seemed like a good idea at the time. Um, but we then started liaising with hospitals. So the point now is to buy an ambulance, fill it with medical equipment and deliver it. Um, Saturday, two weeks ago, uh, I was, worked with a team. We delivered six ambulances to a number of hospitals uh, in Ukraine. Um, we drive uh, Saturday morning, we leave, we get to the border Sunday morning, pedal to the metal, we just keep going until we get to the border and we hand them off to a team uh, in Ukraine who then deliver them. So how does this all come about? Um, so I was told about Nick through, uh, through a separate team and, and we met two weeks ago. After about 10 minutes, we, we decided you know, we were committing ourselves to work together to keep up the momentum and construct uh, something with a bit more efficiency. Lots of groups doing individual things. This, there has to be a, a, a more effective way of doing this. So now with large donors, we have the ability not just to buy an ambulance, but to actually buy what I call a mission, what Nicholas called a, a mission. So that actually means now buying an ambulance and delivering it straight to a hospital in Ukraine, full with all the equipment it needs. So through Robbie Lyle, uh, a, Nick, a collection that, that Nick has, we now have an agreement with the Department of Health and, and Social Care uh, to carry um, ambulances with NHS donated equipment. Um, it was confirmed yesterday um, that we are now partnering with an English registered charity uh, for the benefit of proprietary and gift aid. Um, and now we are building a roster of volunteer drivers um, who can drive the ambulances all the way to Ukraine and then hand off to our, our drivers that we already have uh, stationed in Ukraine. So uh, that's kind of where we've got to very, very quickly. In, uh, what's today? Thursday. On Saturday morning, I shall be leaving again in a convoy of three ambulances. By Sunday morning, we shall be at the border with Ukraine and handing over to, to new drivers. Um, we then go back to the airport, fly home Sunday, and we get home Sunday night, and then back to work on Monday.